In this video we are going to talk about top 10 luxurious apartments in Los Angeles ranging from $85 million to $177 million. So before starting this video like this video. And subscribe to our YouTube channel for future updates. Number 10. Fleur de Lis slash $88.3 million. The outside of the 45,000 square foot Fleur de Lis estate, which is situated on five acres in Holmby Hills, has a steel-framed, limestone face structure. The property includes a gilded ballroom that can accommodate up to 500 guests, a 3,000-square-foot wine cellar with a tasting room, a two-story library, a dance studio, a beauty salon, a music room, and a guest house in addition to 12 bedrooms, 15 bathrooms, a 50-seat theater, a gym, a pool house, extensive formal gardens, a 370-meter running track, and a tennis court. The home was given to Suzanne Saperstein as part of the couple's divorce settlement in 2004, and she listed it for sale for $125 million in 2006. The home sold in March 2014 for $102 million cash to an unnamed Norwegian billionaire after nearly six years on the market. Number 9. Casa Encantada slash $94 million. The enormous 40,000-square-foot Casa Encantada, also known as the Conrad Hilton Estate, is situated on 9.5 acres and is flanked by the fairways of the Bel Air Country Club. In order to construct close to the Bel Air Country Club, Hilda Olsen Bolt Weber paid $100,000 for the site in 1936. She promptly gave the go-ahead for a house to be built. James Delina, an architect, created Casa Encantada, which cost more than $2 million to finish. The mansion's whole interior was custom-designed by renowned interior designer T. H. Robs John Gibbings, including the carpet, fabrics, and furnishings. In October 2019, this enormous Bel Air mansion was relist for $225 million. Number 8. Billionaire slash $94 million. The Billionaire, which was created by upscale developer Makovsky in May 2012, was initially advertised for $250 million in January 2017, making it the most expensive property in the country at the time. It was then reduced to $188 million in April 2018 and then to $150 million in January 2019. After three years on the market, it was ultimately sold to an unidentified bidder in October 2019 for $94 million. The mansion has a 17,000-square-foot deck outside and is situated on a 1.08-acre property. A helipad with an Airwolf replica, an 85-foot glass tile infinity pool, and retractable cinema screens are among the notable features. A beautiful view of Los Angeles, the San Gabriel Mountains, and the Pacific Ocean off Malibu can also be seen from the house. Number 7. Playboy Mansion slash $100 million. Hugh Hefner, founder of Playboy magazine, lived in the Playboy Mansion for many years. It is one of the most well-known luxury homes in Los Angeles. The enormous residence is more than 21,900 square feet and was created by architect Ron Dursmith in the Gothic and Tudor revival styles. It has more than 30 rooms, including a wine cellar, a built-in pipe organ, a home cinema, seven bedrooms, eight bathrooms, and more. Even a separate house on the estate that is only used for entertainment and games. A tennis court, basketball court, zoo, aviary, swimming pool, and famed, or notorious, grotto are among the outdoor attractions. The Playboy Mansion is one of the very few residences in Los Angeles to possess both a permanent firework license and a zoo license. Number 6. The Manor Slash $120 Million The Manor, often known as Spelling Manor, is a 123-room French chateau-style estate measuring 56,500 square feet. It is considerably larger than the White House. The manor, which was built in 1988 for TV producer Aaron Spelling of Beverly Hills 90210, Dynasty, and Charlie's Angels fame, 
was once the location of Bing Crosby's 1932 residence and was designed by architects from James Langenheim and Amp Associates. The estate, which spans five acres of land, also has rose gardens, citrus orchards, rolling lawns, fountains, koi ponds, statues, a pool, and a tennis court. Number 5. 10671 Challen Road slash $133 million. The fourth highest price ever paid in California was paid for 10671 Challen Road, a two-house, four-parcel estate encompassing 4.6 acres, in December 2021 for $133 million. It was the second most expensive home sold in Los Angeles County in 2021. CEO of DIP Corporation and Japanese business magnate Hideki Tomita was the seller. Brian Armstrong, the CEO of Coinbase, made the purchase. The guest house, 10693 Challen Road, was created between 1941 and 1943 by Paul R. Williams. 6,341 square feet of space, five bedrooms, and five bathrooms make up this second home. The private estate is surrounded by hedges and features all the standard amenities, like a tennis court, two pools, one for each house, and a cabana. The estate has exclusive views of the canyon and the city lights because it is perched on a peninsula in Bel Air's Westgate neighborhood close to Hotel Bel Air. Number 4. The 1 slash $141 million. The 1 was once advertised as being the largest, 105,000 square feet, and most costly residence in America, $500 million initial asking price. The one rose to the fourth most expensive residence in Los Angeles when it was sold in March 2022. The construction of the 21-bedroom, 49-bathroom megamansion by Niall Niami took 10 years and was marred by cost overruns and bankruptcy. In the end, the property was sold at auction for $126 million as a result of a court order. The final price was $141 million after the buyer premium of 12%. CEO of Fashion Nova Richard Sagian placed the highest bid. Number 3. Chartwell Estate slash $150 million. Summer Spalding constructed this 25,000-square-foot chateau-style estate in the 1930s under the influence of French neoclassicism. The façade is covered in symmetrically cut and carefully positioned limestone. The interior, which features a vast ballroom, a lofty entrance, and scaled formal chambers, seems like it came straight out of The Great Gatsby. With 26 rooms, a 75-foot pool, gardens created by Henri Samuel, a pool house, and guest quarters created by architect Wallace Neff, the expansive home is situated on more than 10 acres of property. A wine vault with a capacity of 12,000 bottles and an underground garage with 40 parking spaces are a few of this expensive estate's more intriguing features. The first residence was built by civil engineer Lynn Atkinson as a gift for his wife, who thought the estate too pretentious. Then, Hotelier Arnold Kirkaby bought it for $200,000 in the 1940s. Billionaire Jerry Perenchio purchased it in 1986, and he later sold it to Lachlan Murdoch in 2019 for $150 million. The Chartwell Estate is perhaps best known to fans of vintage television as the setting for the CBS sitcom The Beverly Hillbillies, which ran from 1962 to 1971. Number 2. Warner Estate slash $165 million. The Warner Estate is still one of Beverly Hills' most opulent residences. The 13,600-square-foot Georgian-style estate features three hothouses, a swimming pool, a tennis court, beautiful gardens, a nursery, terraces, a nine-hole golf course, a car court, gas pumps, and service garage. Over nine acres make up the property. Number 1. 27740 Pacific Coast Highway slash $177 million. In October 2021, this oceanfront villa in Paradise Cove Bluffs broke the previous record for being the most expensive house in Los Angeles and all of California. The purchase, 
which cost $238 million, was the second highest in the country at the time of sale, behind only billionaire Ken Griffin's acquisition of a New York penthouse. The property was purchased by fashion mogul Serge Azria and his wife Florence Azria in 2013 and consists of two sections that together equal roughly seven acres. They purchased the compound for $41 million eight years ago. Architectural designer Scott Mitchell oversaw a thorough refurbishment during the subsequent years. What do you think about this video? Do let us know down in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from us again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go.